let's go to Henley on Thames in Oxfordshire. This is the 1968 Morris Minor 1000. Designed by engineering genius Alekis Gonis under the watchful auspices of Lord Nuffield, this family automobile is designed to offer the spaciousness, comfort and performance you'd expect from a more expensive German car, for example. Incorporating ingenious double filament tungsten bulbs for both tail and brake lights, and also the flashing amber bulbs on all corners replacing the former semaphore signals, this car features innovation way ahead of its Having admired the chrome flourishes to the exterior trim, you step inside and are immediately impressed by a full leather interior. And believe you or me, for you watching at home, this really is bright red. The uprated 48 horsepower motor spins immediately into life and will propel you onto 60 miles an hour. Enough to give Jerry a run for his money on the autobahns, Otto. As you cruise gracefully along the B roads of Oxfordshire, you notice other improvements for your comfort and safety. Namely, front inertia seatbelts are now standard, and the electric windscreen wipers replace the vacuum driven models of uh, previous iterations. Uh, also, the independent suspension all round ensures more cabin space and a uh, lower central gravity for the engine to uh, enhance your stability and cornering. Constant companion on any journey, short or long, is the A Series engine was designed by Harry Westlake of SS. Now, mysteriously, in the 1940s, uh, this company changed its name to Jaguar. Of proven road and race pedigree since 1951, the overhead camshaft water cooled carburetted straight forward engine offers the proud owner of this particular vehicle guaranteed reliability. So good in fact that Nissan of Japan, known here as Datsun, have decided to adopt the engine in their vehicles from 1966 onwards. Now there are rumours that in the coming decade of the 1970s these Japanese manufacturers plan to flood European, American and British Empire markets with uh, models of superior Economy, reliability, speed, comfort, and technology. <laughs> but I'll believe that when I see it. Strategically priced at a shade under 400 pounds, the discerning purchaser will have to move quickly as British Motor Corporation plans to phase out this model for a futuristic concept car known as the Allegro. Straight out of the blocks, you notice your wisdom on by 60 foot pounds of torque propelling you on to an impressive 77 miles per hour. Now you might think all of this sport performance would hit you very hard in the wallet of the filling station, but quite the contrary, as this vehicle will manage 38 miles per gallon. series straight for engine first second oh I'm guessing a third now I'll just have second third's a long way off to the right Just have second again. Well, we're heading into town now. Let's hope after 10 minutes experience, I've got the car control. Getting plenty warm enough. You can get away from me, Jaguar. That's third. Woohoo! Alright. 
the open road, what does she do? It's very comfortable at 50 and uh, the owner says it will do the legal speed limit easily so I can believe that. Right, going down to third. Oh yes. They put a smile on your face. That's the sign of a good car. And we got fourth. Straight into third. And fourth. I'm in my stride now. I've passed the learning curve and I'm enjoying it. This is beautiful. Don't panic if all that high speed gets a bit out of hand, as those all round drum brakes will soon bring you to a halt. Being a practical family car, there is of course plenty of room in the boot for her indoors to fit the shopping.